Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I did um my natural eyeshadow look and just natural makeup. And like I know y'all see my lips look so juicy and shiny. Like I'm gonna show y'all how I did that because y'all know I don't have no lips at all. They're so little. But in this video, if y'all wanna see how I did that, just keep on just keep on watching. So right here, I'm using my Versali liquid drops. I just put that all over my face. I put way too much, so yeah, don't put as much as I did. This use about one or two, one to three drops. So that's like that's usually what I do. I don't know what I'm doing here, but yeah. So yeah, just put rub that all over my face. Make sure I get everything, and this makes your makeup so flawless. Like it makes it look really good, like airbrushed. And then right here, use my Fenty Beauty foundation. I know it's too light, but guys, I know it's just way too light. But I, I just need to buy some more foundation. But yeah. Excuse me. So yeah, I just blend it in with my beauty blender. Just going in with that. But then I had mixed it with my Too Faced um, foundation. You know the color is chestnut. I mixed that in with that, and it made it look a little better. But I looked in the mirror when I got done with makeup, and it looked pretty good. So there wasn't nothing wrong with it. Like I made it work. So yeah, I just blend it all in, all over my face and everything. I, I, I don't see how you guys like uh, put the foundation in when your baby hair is like I was like oh my gosh like I tried to blend in where my baby hair is but I'm like dang it's gonna look funny if I don't blend it in on my forehead so I try to blend it in a little bit on my baby hair but I mean it looks good like I thought it was gonna look bad cause I thought it would look funny if you don't go up to your forehead where your baby hair is to blend it in but I don't know I don't really wear baby hair like that but Whatever, just t tell me all. Tell me what y'all do. Just write it down in the comments. Tell me guys what you do. So yeah, right here I'm I'm using my um, Fenty Beauty concealer under my eyes, and I put on my forehead, under my chin, and my nose. So I'm just putting that in. And right here I'm using my L'Oreal Infallible long wear shape and stick foundation and I use that for contour I just do my cheeks and my forehead under my chin and my face is fat so I make sure to send it down with this like it, it makes it like look so snatched so yeah go under my chin everything so yeah then I use a brush to blend that blend that in I got these brushes from Amazon I don't remember what the name of them were but yeah that's what I guess so yeah, just blend that in. Like I like using brushes to blend out my um, concealer because it makes it look so flawless. So yeah, I like that. And then I go back in with the beauty blender to make sure it's all just smooth that really good. Oh, and you, if you see me talking and stuff, that's because I have my earphones. And I'm just listening to. And then right here I'm using my LA Girl Concealer. This me yeah, medium beige. So yeah, I use that because I like my um my under eye to look bright. Like I like it to look bright because it makes my face pop. So yeah, I use that too. And I put some on my eyelids too. Because I'm gonna put foundation. I mean not foundation, I'm gonna put eyeshadow on in this video. So yeah, I use the concealer on my eyelids. And then I use my Anastasia Beverly Hills. Um, pomade it's in Auburn I like using lighter colors on my eyebrows because it just makes it look more uh, more like make it pop more that's what I like so yeah I'm just going in with that and then I'm cleaning it in, cleaning it up with my LA girl concealer it was um what was that no not my LA girl I use my Fenty Beauty concealer then I'm um what is this oh I'm using my Lori L'Oreal, L'Oreal, oh my gosh, my um, Laura Mercier um, translucent powder under, under my under eye and my nose and my forehead and my chin. So yeah, I like this powder guys. It's like really good. Then I'm um, cleaning up my contour with it.
And if you guys hear some background background um, music or anything, it's because my nephew's watching TV in the living room. So yeah. And I'm going in with the Julia um, Julia eyeshadow palette. I like I don't know what the colors are, guys, but I'm gonna put all the products in the description box, and I'll put the colors and stuff down there because I can't really think about it right now. But yeah. So yeah, I'm just going in my crease with the color. And I just showed me doing one eye because I didn't want to um, make the video be so long. So yeah. So I'm going in my upper crease with the other color. I use my fingertip. I use a color on my lid. And I'm blending it in some more. Then I'm using my Carmel Carmel Cutie Fenty Beauty um it's not foundation, it's uh contour powder. So yeah, I just put that all over. I hate this brush, guys. I don't even know why I used it, like I hate it. Cause my other brushes were dirty i need to wash them and then i'm cleaning up my um well i'm dusting off the um my l'oreal powder with the um the sephora um uh, the sephora powder like a smooth powder that's why i use to dust that off with first i pat it in though and then right here i'm just contouring my face with the Fenty beauty con uh, contour then make sure i smooth it out good with the beauty then I use a Mario, Mario, the Mario um, spray. I, I don't know how to pronounce that last name, so I'm not even gonna do it. Then I use the other spray. That spray I just showed, it's like really good. I got it from Amazon, it's really good. Then I use my NYX um, powder, I mean my uh, blush, and it's called Pinch. I know I use this, this um, blush all the time, guys, in all my videos, but I really like it. Like, I like it. It shows up on my face. I don't really know that much about blushes and stuff, like, because I'm scared to get the wrong color, and then I'm like, oh, I can't use this anymore. Like, I don't know. I just need to go shopping for more makeup. And then right here, I'm using the Artist Couture um, highlighter. Oh, my gosh, y'all. I love this so much. Like, I love Artist, Artist Couture products. Like, they're so good. Like, I love it. Like, this stuff makes my face so glittery and shiny and blingy like i love it it's cocoa bling oh my gosh it's so good like i got the sample when i ordered something from savora i'm like dang this stuff is good so i ordered the bigger um bigger the bigger thing of it and oh my gosh like i love it like i go i wear it all the time all my tutorials like that's how much i love it like it's so good and then i went in with my uh i got this l'oreal translucent uh powder glow and it's more marseilleur i use that for my eyes because I like my under eye to pop, so yeah, I put that up under there to make it just look really good and pop. So yeah, and then I'm going in with a brown, um, I think it was a brown uh, pencil, yeah, brown pencil on my lips, and then I'm going in with this, um, this lip gloss stuff I got from, um, I think it was Charlie Rouge or something like that, and then I'm just blending that in with my finger, and then I got this from the Dollar, the dollar Tree, to be honest. Yeah, I got this from the Dollar Tree, it's like some little cheap gloss I had found. But yeah. Yep, I'm going with that. And the product that you guys need to make your lips like look more, so juicy and plump. It's like um what is it? I forgot the name of it guys, but it's um hmm. So it's called Pillow Plump Extra Large XXXXL Soap and Glory. Like, do you guys, this stuff is called Sexy Mother Pucker. So this stuff is what you need to make your lips look, look like, look juicy and plump. Like, it, but it stinks a little bit, but I, I like it. It makes my lips so, look so big and juicy, even though I ain't got no lips. But this is what you need to make your lips look so plump. To make them so plump and juicy, that's what you need if you don't have no lips. If you got lips, you don't need this. But yeah, it makes it tingle like you like it makes it tingle and you can feel it swelling up too. But yeah, that's what I use on my lips is this stuff. And then also I use like a MAC, um my MAC lip gloss. I forgot the name of it, but I'm gonna put auto products. I know I keep saying this, but I'm gonna put auto products in the description box. But yeah, guys, and that's the end of the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And make sure you like, share, and subscribe. I love you guys so much. Bye.